Hey man, pour some old Henny in this cup, nigga. You know, some of y'all probably went out back smoking and shit, but you know, I don't really get into all that. <laughs> yeah. Man. Boy, it's been a long ass week, nigga. Huh? Huh? We're all in the same game, different levels, and we're dealing with the same hair. But different devils looking up to the sky to ask the Lord to propel us. See, see that girl I want when you see fit to email us. When she finally text you back, she say she miss you, but she only hits your line. Cause you're convenient, so just tell her be specific. It's so essential, cause there are way too many credits with no credentials. And you know that I ain't stunting at all. This is lovely. You ready? Yo, check this out. This is the, what, the sixth installment of Cooling with AC. I got two amazing guests with me. It's going to be a great episode. You feel me? Um, AB and Lotus. Man, they bringing, they bringing the vibe today. Go ahead and introduce y'all yourselves, man. Nice ladies, it's ladies. Okay. Y'all about the women. You know, well, I'm candy-coated AB. Um... Lyricist, I don't say rapper, female lyricist, and a dancer, choreographer. You name it, pretty much I do it. Uh, what's going on, everybody? I'm Lotus Music. Um, I'm an artist. Uh, I'm a ladies' man. Yeah. You know, I, I just be chilling, man. You know, I'm all about the vibes. Yeah. About that. yeah, you're a renaissance man. Yeah. man I, I've been checking out your material, bro. And uh, one thing I did like is that that short film, that baby joint, bro. Yeah, I, I watched yeah. that, man. How did you? What what inspired you to do that? Um, for one, shout out Wesley Crutcher. That's my Most boy. Definitely shout, shout out Wesley five Crutcher, out. man. Five, five out. out, shout out, five out music. Uh, but we 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 had wanted we had wanted like a different vibe. We had, mm -hmm. we had wanted to get out of the city. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And he had some connections in Chattanooga. That's where we were. Um, so we drove down there, got a, got to looking at all the scenery. You feel me? And we just we shot the video. Like it was it was cool little temperature. So we were able to be outside and do what we wanted to do. It wasn't really too cold. You feel me? Yeah. So it was just it was just a cool little vibe, man. It was just I liked it. I about to say how long it take for y'all to do that. Um, one day, actually. Oh, dope. That's good. Yeah, that, that, that's that, that, good. That's <laughs> that, that look good. Yeah, you, brought, you brought it back, man. That was that's that. That was that. Oh, look, no, the, we have way. to go back and bring then come into <laughs> yeah, the man. Yeah. for people who don't so, know. Yeah, man. For people so. who have no idea, you need oh, to go yeah. check it out. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, that baby Lotus yeah. music directed by Wesley Crutcher, man. Yeah, that's okay. dope, man. <laughs> and I saw I saw the little I saw the documentary too. I thought oh, that yeah, was dope, yeah, man. Yeah. Like, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now how long it take for y'all to do that joint? Right that was there? that was over a course of a couple weeks. Okay. Um, cause it was crazy, man. I, I was booked for a whole month. Booked and busy, booked huh? Booked and busy for booked a whole month. Busy. So we literally did that every single weekend. Like I had some. I was booked for like a Sweet Sixteen birthday party, mm -hmm. and I had something to do at uh, my old middle school. My um. My middle school principal was like, he keeps in touch with me and he follows me and my right. music and all that. Like, That's it's crazy. He was like, yo, Lo, can you? Well, he didn't call me Lo, he called me by my government name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, he called me by my government name. He was like, yo, I need you to come back. I see you moving with the music. All the teachers are following you, all that. It's crazy. I need you to come back and talk to the kids and perform for the kids. Because they have, they have a music right. program now. Okay. They, have a, they have a real recording studio in the middle school, and he told me, he was like, man, I'm glad we had this when you was here. Yeah, because you would have been yeah. used wow, in studio skip hours. class. It's <laughs> over it. I'm recording. Right. I would have found right. that I had to do that by myself, and I would have yeah. recorded. But, um, nah, man, shout out Thurgood Marshall Middle School. Thurgood Marshall I was about to ask what middle school you went to. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, Marshall. yeah. Okay. Yeah, 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 that's what's up. Show that. Yeah, so who, um, who inspired you to get into music, or how did you, like, decide, like, okay, this is what I'm going to do. This is, yeah. this is me I'm an artist yeah I'm I've always I've always been a fan of Lil Wayne my brother put me on Lil Wayne yeah. man, like the old Wayne Frank, Frank Wayne album Carter Three. Carter. Carter that's Three. Carter. Yeah, Carter yeah. Three. Car the Carter was my. Well, I know drought. Don't say drought. No, that's a that's the, a big was hard. The drought was hard, but not harder than the Carters. Ooh. Not harder than the Carters. That's the drought was. Just, I don't know. They they drought two. Three was a mom. No, it drought was. Drought Three. But yeah. <laughs> it's three a couple of like right. the old Lil Wayne is more relevant. But I, that's the one I love. I yeah. love Lil Wayne. Show man. 
you know, acting brand new, you know, riding through the and city. And then, that like, <laughs> people, other people that I, you know what I'm saying, straight inspiration, inspiration from, Drake. Drake, man. Yeah. Like, yo, when I tell yeah. you, Drake is... Yeah, I, yeah. make sure y'all recording this, man. So when I meet this man, I need everybody to be like, damn, Lo said yeah. gonna meet Drake. I promise you. Mm -hmm. That dude, like, dude, for real, for real. Cause like, I'm not, I couldn't, I couldn't really relate to Lil Wayne. You feel me? I'm not, I'm not from the hood. I'm not right. Right. picking bricks and doing all that. You feel me? Like, I'm a regular kid, you know, mm -hmm. like I'm from Antioch, you know. I got, I have, you know what I'm saying, two parents, you feel me? Like, so I, I really live life, you feel me? And Drake, you feel me? He, he like he explained like yo you don't gotta be tough bro you can really make good music for the women that I'm I, I love women like mm -hmm. because of him like I really want to make music for women like it's it's deeper than just music like, and that's really where the the market is at anyway because yeah, wherever man. women go that's but where the, the guys gonna follow the yeah, guys man. gonna follow wherever we like it you know what I'm saying the women go too so that's great that's a great lane I mean that's so many people that did it. Mm -hmm. Did well off going that that's line, so, but still staying genuine yeah, that's, too that's yourself so, too. And I feel like that's that's so important in today's world because man, you know it's everybody's a you know I'm finna kill you, I'm finna that's shoot fine, you, fine. I, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Everybody that, yeah, but you know what I'm saying? But not if that's you, that's you. You feel me? Yeah. Like that's you on that, stand on that. You feel me? But yeah. I know when it comes to me, that's not me, man. I rather make music for the women. I rather you know what I'm saying? Talk to the ladies, talk about life, talk about what I go through, talk about me grinding. You know, yeah. you know like. I feel yeah. like there's more regular people on the earth than there are niggas trying to kill niggas. You feel me? Like, <laughs> right, right. I, I'm trying to make music for the modern day dude who goes to class, man. He had a mm -hmm. relationship problem. He's going through it with his mom. Like, you feel me? And then also, he still turns up. I still got the music that people can, you know what I'm saying, bang. I still got the music people can have fun to. You feel me? Yeah, for, for real, sure. Hey, B, what, what's the first thing you listen to whenever you listen to a song? When like, I what, get what? in the car no like what like what catches your ear when you first oh the beat it? most definitely okay. beat. Uh, it has to be a beat that i can ride I feel you. no coming with you <laughs> um, <laughs> but it has to be a beat that i can ride most definitely yeah. i have to be able to bob my head to it and i gotta be able to be dancing to it that i don't even and so, not even notice that i'm dancing to it you yeah. know it could just come on in my head just automatically oh yeah you know but that's the first thing instrumentals you know yeah. 808s all of those like it has to be the beat what about Thanks. you like you're yeah. an artist like we are all artists so yeah, if yeah, you yeah. if you get a track you know a producer send you a track yeah. and you can't bob your head to it and you can't catch the flow there's no track if, the, if i can't Nothing like I, if i can't freestyle on it the first three seconds of me listening to it i'm probably not gonna rap on it yeah, yeah. you see what i'm saying i like it i like, I like it too it's like for, for me, for me, I, I always have like a melody or something in my mm -hmm. head, like mm -hmm. always, like even when I'm not listening to beats. So, mm -hmm. you know, I, I often try to match some of those melodies with some of the melodies that I was thinking about earlier, you feel me? Mm -hmm. And then if it doesn't really go, then I'm like, nah, it's gone to the next one. Mm -hmm. The beat is like the soul of, of, it, of the music for me. It's like the soul. Yeah. That should grab you before anything because before yeah. any lyrics come on the beat, in a song, the beat hits first. Absolutely. The beat. Absolutely. The um, beat. I was about to say, so um, how did you get your foot in the door on, on the scene, dog? Like, um, I would, I would really, I would really have to, you know, what I'm saying, shout out, shout the out. The people Wesley you surround Crutcher. yourself yeah. with. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. the people I surrounded myself with. Man. Yeah. I, I got it. I got to shout out Wesley Crutcher, man. I shout him out too. He's dude, been family for dude, years. Dude, 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 really like. Help me, bro. Yeah, like, shout out Wesley Crutcher, man. Like, that's actually, that's actually, you, how you here, Wesley, man. he done a lot of fun. That's how we yeah. met. Yeah, that's how, that's that's how, how we met. Yeah, okay. Yeah, like, we done a couple good, projects bro, together. Bro, oh, that's real. Real. Like, bro, for real deal, like, help me, bro. Like, talking about take 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 me under your wing. Like, come on, dude. Like, I'm, I'm going to help you. Like, and bro, really help me. Like, so I told him, I'm like, bro, any interview, like, e like even if we not a part of the same thing, like, even, you know what I'm saying, I'm over here now, you over here now, but bro, like, you really looked out for me, bro. I'm a forever Love to this really? day, he does the same That's for me. Good. That's yeah, family, forever. and it's always gonna be family. Forever, no matter what my situation is, no matter who I sign to, no matter whatever, I'm always mm -hmm. gonna, you know, what I'm saying respect, bro. Always, mm -hmm. most definitely. Out. What do y'all see on um, the wave of music in five years? I would say, man, I, f I, you know, I feel like, I feel like lyrics are slowly approaching back, but I, I, I don't mm -hmm. feel like they're really hidden, like how, like how mm -hmm. they're supposed to. But I feel like. I feel like the producers are really gonna. I feel like the producers are gonna be the new rappers. Man, yeah, bro. Like, dude, when I tell you, producers are like the wave. Like, bro, Metro Boom and, and Take DJs Keith. Too. Shout out Take Keith. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. From Memphis, goes okay. to MTSU, going crazy. I already had 
for number one say like come on man like the producers are really going crazy out here so shout out to the producers man for real. i think that like honestly is music is slowly but surely trickling back to its roots because you see a lot of producers as he said doing a lot more samples than they used man. to right like now sample older music is coming back like yeah. Every artist has a sample song from something way back in the day. And when you hear that beat, you're like, oh, that's that feel good. And that's <laughs> yeah, how they think they're going to yeah. get everybody listening to their shit. You get a sample of a feel good mm -hmm. song, you know, yep. I want to be on um, the boom. Yeah. Then put a fast yeah. beat behind it. Man, it's a wrap. Yeah, it's exactly. a wrap. Like, you got to know what exactly. to do with it. Okay. Most definitely. Who are y'all's favorite producers? Like, and just give me, like, your top three producers. Like, all time. Pharrell. Zaytoven. Polo. For me. Oh shit. They just oh, eat yeah. shit up. Oh, I yeah, can't they, they, I cannot yeah. not say Timberland. I'm sorry. I Timber, have to. Timberland is my Because he got Timberland some like on my top. Ugh, he yeah. got some uh. Yeah. So like he got some of that when you listen to it, you be like, ugh, yeah. that's nasty. Like yeah. so, so you talking about so you talking about like Period. Of all, of all time. Of all, just, yeah, your, mind, your personal, yeah. Mind, of all time. Yeah, your all, your all time favorite. I would say, man, for one, bro, I got to give it to the youth, man. Shout out Takey, bro. And he's okay. young, bro. I know I just shouted him up, but, bro, he's going crazy. Yeah. Um, I would say, um, I would go with Pharrell too, man. I listen, I listen to a lot of old Snoop Dogg, like with my uncles and stuff. You feel me? And that was back when they was going crazy. Um, and, and and he has hits with like all the greats, bro. Like you gotta think, bro. Yeah. It really has hits. Anybody has hits. Um, and then I would I would have to say Cool and Dre. Cool and Dre. Oh shit. Cool and Dre. Damn. Cool yeah, and you, you do your you do your homework. Research, research. Yeah, you do his homework. They they, they uh they yeah. produce. Listen, they they produce um Drake's. Lord knows on the oh Take Care God. album. Oh my god, that's my Drake that's one of my favorite songs. You feel me? And yeah. like like that that. Yeah. yeah, Cool and Dre hard. Back, yeah, for real. Um, it was going crazy. Cool and yeah, Dre. Yeah, Cool and Dre hard. Uh, my top three are Pharrell Timlin, and then I like uh, there you go. I like uh, the Futuristics that do uh, like Dom Kennedy stuff. And oh, what you know about that Dom Kennedy? Come on, Dom man. Now, you know, we can talk about this all night. Yeah, Dom, Dom, Dom Kennedy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they get bro. That, that's that fly shit. You feel me? We got some local producers here that do our thing. That do oh, their thing too. We got oh, yeah. well, he's not local anymore. But we got Six Sense. We got Band Play. Yeah. You know they yeah. out here going. They going hey, crazy. he's out here going bananas. Yeah. You know what I'm Facts. saying? So yeah. like Shout these out people, local producers, all man. local producers. All yeah. local. They, so, my boy Crash good. Max. Hey, so. Everybody. Um, yeah. If y'all could create your own subgenre for your particular style, what would you name? <laughs> <laughs> look, all look, look, look at me like, nah, yeah. I'm saying. Shit. You know? I might speak for itself. It's that drip. It's that candy coated flow. It's you know that hard on the outside, but I still touch on the inside because mm -hmm. it still get a piece of you. Yeah. Just, that's that candy coated drip. I feel you. That's yeah. just that on that. Shit. Um, my shit would just be called fly shit. Fly. I feel you. Fly, just fly. You know what I'm saying? Like just music, just everyday cool yeah. shit. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Fly shit. Hot shit. I don't know. Like, I got some type of. Like, my vibe is like a passenger seat, like, type. Type right. joint or like is your cousin like let's take a ride to the store real quick. Is it gin and juice? Bust, bust a block is real it quick. Is it gin and type, juice? Okay, type, type, type flow. Gin and juice. It's more of a like. Damn. What is it? What's the laid back? Go pick up some Rillos at the crib. I like and maybe at, at, at yeah. the store real quick and then come back. I like, that, I like that Memphis shit, like that Project Pack. That, yeah. that, Almost that, definitely. That, that, that will never die. Yeah. That will never you know die. What I'm saying? Yeah. I fuck with that, man. Damn, Memphis so, so. artists are on a whole different level. Oh my god, yeah. they music, they dance and music, everything is just a whole different. Well, Memphis been in for real though. Man, I mean, you think about been. it, the South been running this shit for a long time, but that's you know. Don't argue. Sorry. It may, it may be. Because people want to. We've been running. Shit. I mean, we've been. I mean, overall, the the like, especially the past twenty years, almost, mm -hmm. almost the past twenty years. Been everything has been in, like been coming through Atlanta mm -hmm. and through Atlanta. We set trends here, For and then they up. filter through the East and For the shut West up. Coast. Yeah. And shut and then and then the West Coast has been the most consistent. And what I mean, like through the through their beginning, they've never really lost a step, in my opinion. Um, they've always had good artists. You know what I'm saying? You can name them Kendrick. You can name. Um, let me see, Nipsey, you can name a whole That's bunch of different people. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They've been consistent. You know you got the OGs out there too. And then, you know, the East Coast guys, you know, they got they they got they stuff too. They don't never show us love. Well, they try to bite our style, but they don't you know they, they show they show love now, now that they need us, but 
in the beginning, you know, yeah, people don't want to hear nobody. West Coast versus country, South. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I get it. So, it, you know, um, yeah. Yeah, that shit is strange. But um, what other ventures you got outside of, you know what I'm saying, doing music? Um, clothes, man. I love I love making clothes. I like going shopping. I like doing a lot of stuff with clothes, man. Like my own clothing brand. Like I got Lotus Music shirts that my that actually get made here. You feel me? Shout out Cliff, man. We doing the stuff. Um, shout out 340. Yeah, yeah, shout out Studio 340, Jeffo, man. You know it's family, but yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, I like <laughs> I, I like I love clothes, man. I love rocking my own clothes. I love wearing other people's clothes. Like I don't I don't I feel like you know you shouldn't really go spend money on the big names when you got people in your city like everything i got on right now is made in nashville yo like and this hat like mm -hmm. i just got this today like you feel me like everything is support your people yeah you got to i'm big on that man i love supporting my people yeah. i love wearing my people's clothes i love like seeing everybody winning you know that's it bro. if not that's nobody about, wins really. if you don't have no support or nothing behind you you can't go in show sure, man yeah really. that's crazy um i saw somebody post something earlier on ig about how somebody won't um, like compliment somebody on what they're doing, but go in the shade room and comment on somebody that'll completely ignore them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's stuff crazy, like that. That's right? crazy. That's yeah, crazy, and it, it, it's that's just crazy. wild what type of. Um, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? What type of stuff that we do? You know what I mean? And I wonder why that is. I mean, like people's mental state. It's enough important. food on the table for everybody to eat. I think people are scared of competition. They're scared of change. They're scared of new things. You know, a lot of people out here do the same thing. And mm -hmm. my thing is, you know, people can do the same thing that you do, but they can't do it how you do it. Right. So yeah, man. everybody brings something different to the table. A lot of a no. lot of rappers out here, but they don't yeah. have your flow. They don't have your soul. They don't have the experiences that you have. They might, but they might not be able to tell about it how you do in your music. Mm. And facts, they might not man. be able to reach people through That's their facts. music like you do. You feel me? That's facts, it's all about man. how you use your resources and your yeah. tools. Come on now. I, I Everybody ain't like, giving the same tools. Yeah, I also think it's like a, I kind of think it's like a crab in a bucket effect sometimes, man. Like, mm -hmm. especially, especially, and I hate to say it, but especially in the black community, yo. Mm -hmm. Like, that's, that's, like, it's, that's, that's an actual fact. Right? That's horrible, man. Like, okay. you know what I'm saying? You you see, like, yeah. you see one of your homies, man. Like, he's really trying to be great. Like, you see him really working. You feel me? Mm -hmm. But but instead, you choose to ignore him. You choose to not not bring up with like, bro. That's not real, bro. Mm -hmm. That's horrible. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. I got friends who I got friends who make clothes. I got friends who rap. Like I'm always motivating them. I'm always telling them, hey, keep going. I'm always, you know, what I'm saying like for real, for real, because it's all about elevation, man. You know, yeah. I want to see everybody work together, man, so we all can, you know, elevate. And one one thing, Jay Z said a line, bro, that like was everything. He said, um, he said. Um, Hold up, hold up, hold Grab up, hold up. It. It's up, right there. It's, it's right there. It's right Grab there. Grab it. Um, <laughs> he said, generational wealth, that's the key. My parents ain't have shit, so that shift started with me. I feel like it's all mm. generational wealth, mm. like, especially with the younger generation. You feel me? Like, a lot of these kids' parents ain't have nothing. You feel me? So, mm. I, you know, gener like wealth is a generation thing. So, if a kid gets money, you feel me, and he can recycle all that back into the community so everybody can elevate, you feel me? Yeah, man. Like, for real. I'm all about that, man. I'm, you know what I'm saying? My bad, y'all. No, you good? You no, no, no. no. I just want to see people. This is free game. People need to actually I want to see yeah. people be great, man. Like, for real, for real. What, what do you think it'll take for the Nashville artists to completely, like, make some noise, com like, overall? Not just one artist doing this and the other artist doing that, like, in its entirety, yeah. blow up and be our own city. Cause we're growing. You know what's crazy, man? I re I really see a growth in support, oh, really? bro. Like yeah. when it comes to the rappers, bro. Like for real, like bro. They're I really see a you. growth in support, bro. Like everybody working, bro. People is really getting noticed. People is getting on around here, bro. Like, and it's crazy. Like it don't matter. It don't matter where you're from. It don't matter. You know what I'm saying? What you, whatever, bro. Like, if it's good music, it's good music, bro. Like, I got people. people <clears throat> yeah, I got people who you would never think that I'm cool with. Like, damn, bro. <laughs> like, you can walk up to that. Like, yeah, bro. Like, it don't matter, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? People is really starting to support each other, bro. I love it. Yeah. Like, We're not gonna go anywhere it. without support. We can, it, we can damn sure make some noise with, with support. We support each other. I love it. Because I mean, like, we went to an event, and it was actually what was it, the Nemo Awards? Mm -hmm. Wasn't the Nemo Awards? Oh, and there were country, you. country yeah. singers there. It was like, pretty at that too. My thank mom, you. My <laughs> uh, sorry, y'all. 
So there were like country singers there, and like the, to be able to network with those type of people. When you see those people, you know you're in a you're a rapper, you're a lyricist, and then you sure. see a country artist, and they're like, "Hey, you Candy Coat and AB, what's up? I be seeing your work. That's well, big because that, that, that's somebody from a whole different you know yeah. genre of music. Know, you like, damn, I must be working. You know I what know I mean? Me. Those are the type of people you <laughs> need to split your head, you know <laughs> your feet and your hands in all types of different stuff and yeah. get noticed by different people. Different yeah. collabs like Thanks. that put you on free game. Country music. Rock. Free game. I'm trying to go to the rock show, man. I'm trying to you jump in the crowd. Okay. Crowd serve. Yeah. I know, they can, I know they can pick my little ass up. Nah, I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna miss. Yeah, they will pick your little ass up. Shit. <laughs> Next topic. No. <laughs> Sit down. Y'all ready to see? So me. for both. So so both of y'all. Have all a seat. Right. So if you had, all right, you're doing a dream collab album. You can pick one producer and one extra artist to do your dream collab album with. Who would it be? I'm already know. I'm going with Drake. Um, that's off the rip. Like Drake, I'm trying to think of the producer. Mm -hmm. That would be. That's a. Uh, that's tough, yo. Mm -hmm. That's tough. And man. the producer had to produce every track. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Um, okay, I know I'm going with Jizzy, but I would have to say. I might go with, I'm gonna go with, I'm a man real talk, man. I'm gonna go with Zaytoven. Okay. Like, okay. I'm gonna I'm I'm keep it, I'm gonna I'm keep that shit, I'm gonna keep that shit all the way south. I'm gonna keep that shit all the way south. You know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we gonna, we gonna be lit. I'm gonna still rap, I'm gonna still do my thing. Zaytoven does all kinds of beats. Like, he just don't do trap shit. Like, Brett yeah. plays the piano at his church. Like, yeah. he, he knows he way yeah, more. He These dudes be knowing how to play yeah, his You know what I'm saying? Bruh, bruh is really yeah. talented, but I say, Jesse, sure. man, then we gonna with Zaytoven, man. We gonna keep that shit banging. We yeah. gonna be lit. For sure. What about you? Honestly, if I had to do an album and just have it produced by someone, it would more than likely be Pharrell. Yeah. I mean, he got some some sounds, some you know, some ideas that cool. nobody else. He's create very, very creative. Not to say anyone else isn't, but that's just who I would pick to do it with. As far as an artist. I'm more, I most I probably would do it with somebody different, like just and not even have you know somebody who could rap and sing on a track, you know maybe mm -hmm. could rap on one track, sing on the other. Take mm -hmm. it back, Erica Badu. Damn you know, it, give me too. that flow, give me that that feel good, that sit back, that lean back, that by the window seat, you know, flow. Ah, oh, that was you. Man, like well, you Slick took all of both. Yeah. Really, great minds think alike. Damn. I mean, that's that's good music. You feel me? Yeah, no, that's those are two wonderful artists. You good? Too. I mean, I that mean, just says something about us as artists. Yeah. Man. Like, it's yeah, man. Dope um, shit. Mine would be Soundwave from TDE. TDE. Wow. Yeah. Soundwave would be my producer, and I will take. She took a haircut, so I'm gonna have to take. <laughs> I'm gonna have to um. Go with Uncle Three Stacks, man. Okay, Andre. Andre. I'm gonna Andre take Uncle Three. I like him. His flow is because, amazing. Because uh, I feel like he, yeah, he put, he, he teach me a lot. You know what I'm saying? I can learn a lot from him. Outcast, period. You know what I'm saying? That, 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 like he definitely got that uh, Uncle vibe. Like you know what I'm saying? Like he don't. His lyrics, of all yeah, time. yeah, yeah. To make you be like, how the fuck did you say that? Drake be doing the same thing though. It's like how do you, how do you, how do you word it? Like how do you take that and word it that way and make it sound so good? Like the delivery. The content, all of that in one. Like, how do you make it sound so good and explain it in a, such a concise manner? Like, you got to be a rap junkie to understand it like that. But no, yeah, I get it because you you'll take his verse, break it down, rewind it, listen to it again, and then break it down again and rewind it again. And be like, oh, he crazy. Yeah, yeah he man. He crazy. Or yeah. or even if it's not about the lyrics, if the music is just relatable, like mm -hmm. be like, damn, like bro, I really went through that shit. Yeah. I was really in high school thinking about that girl, like, damn, bro, really talking to me right now, like, for real, for real. Yeah, for real. yeah fuck dude, because he's that good. So, um, besides the point, now, nah, um, go ahead, y'all, y'all, um, give y'all's tags and stuff, man. Oh, candy-coated AB, just how it sounds. Yeah. Um, my bad, I, I gotta do, I gotta do the most, but, uh, do, it. do it the most, do it, man. Do it, do it, it's not um, you if you don't do it. It's, it's Lotus Music, you know, the Young Gun, the... The young bull, ladies, man, you feel me? Just be chilling, doing my thing. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, crazy. What can we reach? Lotus we music. Yeah, oh, where yeah, can we find yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you? Can, uh, you can follow me at Lotus Music. L O T I S M U S I C, you feel me? All in one word. I prefer the women. You know, but I mean, what's up, niggas? What's up, y'all? <laughs> uh, yeah, man, you can follow me. Shit. 
I'm on all streaming platforms, okay. Apple Music, Spotify, Amazon, Tidal, you name it, I'm on it. You feel me? So, yeah, yeah that's me, man. Shout out Massey TV. Shout out Massey TV. They love. anchor love, love. Massey TV, the platform. This you is not the, with it, the, pl the, the, the platform. The platform. Man. Wait, shut up. <laughs> Um, yeah, and this is AC, man, you know what I'm saying, your cousin to take that walk after Thanksgiving, you know what I'm saying, oh, before Thanksgiving meal, you know before what I mean? the meal, before the meal, come back, take that walk. smoke break, yeah, man, nah. <laughs> smoke break, yeah, man, but, smoke yeah. Break. but yeah, this is the sixth installment of Cool and AC, we out, fam, yeah, oh. hey. yeah, I'm gonna kick it off. Ringing off the hook, it's your father. Bitch is steady hating, but I am never bothered. I got a couple carrots that I carry around my collar, and his girl gave me her number, but no, I will never call her. Yes, I holler. If he hits me in my nook and cranny, got me bent up like a pretzel, you can call me Auntie Annie. I like the way you look at me. Your name could be Sammy, got me higher than a kite. Please prepare me for my landing. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, oh. Back to the bakery to get some bread I go Yo, your nigga tried to give me head I had to tell him no Could give a fuck about your feelings But I know he just a hoe Here we go We got Lotus and AC And see me, I go by candy coated AB You know me Because I used to be with your father <laughs> Yeah, that's probably why these bitches out here bother Hey, yeah Bitch love from the yacht, they love my shit, man, the nigga can't stop. They yell on my feet, that y'all niggas gon' flop. Cat when you rap, say you grew up in blocks. They be like, low, I don't like this. Tin this chain drip, up, go drip. Know some gang members, I know some real killers, I just do me. Keep it cool, get my name, nigga, yeah, yeah. They thought I was done, thought I was doing this, that shit for fun. Bitch, I'm your pappy, and you are my son. Shot it so thick, man, that ass weigh a ton. Hold up, wait, we pull up in charge, just watch the prices right. Shout out my bar, cause stacking these chest in my feature price right large. Just smashing your mama, I am your father, your bitch a star. Cause smash them one time, so we having a daughter. Rip the bird all, it's low, it's so hard. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Oh man, look. Look at that. Oh, they killed this shit. Hold on. You know how niggas be taking this in. Look, drop all that. <clears throat> Yo. Uh. Uh. Keep the same energy. Allegedly finna be having a blast like the head off of Kennedy. Tragic assembly. Ask who defended your passion with your enemies. Glad you befriended me. As you pretend to be glad you stabbed me in the back to get rid of me. That's so me, man. You must have believed that you could be trusted with ease. But when you deceive me, then you cut off like a sleeve and shut off my back to freeze me. Ooh. Out, out of my mind, deleted. The cloud is a sign you conceded. You got to be blind, not to see them. My shine is repeated. We finally keep me in alignment. The assignment call through the sign I saw. Through the shade of the tree of all. Praise be Allah or to Christ. Any would suffice. Nothing is as nice as my cup runneth over twice. I put that on my life. <laughs> 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 okay. Nigga trip so low, low got you. I got bitches, money, and real niggas all in my crew. Ain't nothing sweet, little nigga be chill, don't get shit confused. I'm in the M town at the bluff, I killed that shit too. Bust down, rolling on me, 40k, my wrist so icy. She love the way how I perform, little bitch wanna bite me.